for their countries in war, and all who have lived and died in the service of humankind. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, infinite in wisdom, love and power, have compassion on those for whom we pray, and help us to use all suffering in the cause of your kingdom. Through the one who gave himself for us on that cross on Calvary's hill, Jesus Christ our Lord. Grant, O merciful God, that with malice towards none, with charity to all, with firmness in the right as you give us to see right, we may strive to finish the task which you have appointed to us. To bind up the nation's wounds, to care for those who have borne the battle, and for the widow and the orphan, to do all that may achieve and cherish a just and lasting peace among ourselves and with all nations, through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Almighty and eternal God, from whose love in Christ we cannot be parted, either by death or life, hear our prayers and thanksgiving for all whom we remember this day. Fulfill in them the purpose of your love and bring us all with them to your eternal joy, through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Days shall grow not old, as we that are left grow old. Age shall not weary them, nor the years condemn. At the going down of the sun, and in the morning, we will remember them. We will remember them. Father, whose will is our peace, turn all our hearts to you, that by the power of the Holy Spirit, your peace may be established throughout the whole world, through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. We're now going to have the national anthem that's going to be played, but there will be no singing of the words of the national anthem. It will just be played by the radio.
We'll know how the reef's laying under the direction. Thames Valley, please.
our final blessing. God grant to the living grace, to the departed rest, to your church, the Queen, the Commonwealth, and all humankind, peace and accord. And now may the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be upon us, remain with us, and be with all people everywhere, this day and forevermore. Amen. Now, thank you all very much indeed for coming this morning for this short service here at the War Memorial, rather different to what we normally have. But thank you all for your participation. And now, thank you. I now dismiss the parade and anybody else then who wants to lay wreaths or whatever at the memorial may do so once the barriers have been removed after half past 11. Thank you all again for coming.